Hello, my lovelies. Hello, hello, hello. How do you do? How do you do? How do you do? Welcome back to my channel, That Girl Crystal. Today we are doing a story time. This story. <laughs> This story is very interesting. That's all I gotta say. So grab your cup of tea, of juice, of wine, whatever you want in here right now is a little bit of gin and some lemonade. Right, so this story is about the time I got jumped by a bunch of dudes. I got jumped by a bunch of dudes. I got jumped by a bunch of dudes now this this should have never happened the situation was just a mess and it really shouldn't have escalated to that point of me getting jumped but anyways so also I gotta say like this story is even more effed up because a family member was involved and she really could have helped, but she didn't want to. She's probably gonna watch this video and she's gonna be like, oh my God, like, I feel so bad. Bitch, you should feel bad. You should feel bad. I mean, I've seen her at the family functions after that incident, incident, incident. When I see her, I'm just like, But let's get into the story. It's good. It's good. How this story started, okay? So my cousin, we're gonna call her, we're gonna call her Red. I don't know. It's the first thing I was just looking at something and it was the color red. Let me tell you a little backstory first of how we met these people. So obviously Red's my cousin. So me and my sister went to Red's birthday party. She had it at a club and this guy was like the promoter or it was his event or something. We're gonna call this promoter guy attention because he just loved attention. And he was an attention seeker and he really thought he was the man when really you is a little boy. That's all I gotta say. So Red invited me and my sister to Attention's event, which was her birthday, but it was his event. So obviously I went to this event with my sister and my other friend. That's how we met um, Attention. I feel like Attention was feeling my sister or whatever. My sister was just like, no you a baby like <laughs> you a baby <laughs> so obviously a couple months passed and attention is like to my sister oh i'm having a boat party for my birthday i'm gonna be turning 20 something i don't even think he even knew how old he was to be honest because he was telling my sister that he was turning 25 so it was his 25th birthday and i was just like okay that don't really make sense but okay he was like to my sister oh it's my 25th birthday come along bring your sister yeah red's coming with her friends and yiddy 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 yeah so i was seeing me and my sister just like oh yeah boat party like boat parties are lit we went to one like a couple years back and it was lit so me and my sister were just like okay we're gonna go to this boat party we love to party on boat so obviously we get there now. <laughs> so obviously we get to the boat party. We got on, we saw Red and um, Red was with a friend and let's call her, let's call her vodka cause she loved to drink like she was a party party. So Red was there with vodka on this boat. Okay, so on this boat you go in and then there's like the dance floor bit and then there's like the outside bit where like you can like smoke or just chill outside on the outside of the boat 
if that makes sense. And then you have downstairs, which is like more of like a lounge area where you can just sit and chill. There's a bar, but there's like no DJ down there. So that's only, that's like the lounge bit is the, like the quiet bit. So obviously we have now, me and my sister Red and Vodka have now gone down to the lounge bit. We see attention. So obviously we were there. They give us our complimentary Prosecco and so we drank that and then we got like drinks at the bar so the night's booming night's booming and obviously so later on so i left my sister downstairs with um some guy she was talking to and i went upstairs with vodka to go out on the outside bit <clears throat> to smoke or whatever so obviously now this is where this is what my sister told me so basically my sister was downstairs and some guy gave her a bottle of i don't know if it was vodka or champagne or something it was like an expensive bottle of alcohol so this guy told my sister to hold the bottle and watch it just watch the bottle so obviously my sister's like, okay, cool, yeah, I'll watch your bottle. <clears throat> so then apparently this girl, who by the way looked like, she looked like Shrek with braids. I'm not going to lie. She looked like Shrek with braids. So obviously she gets pissed off at my sister and is just like, why are you holding my bottle? This is my bottle. Like, who said you can have my bottle? Like, that's my bottle. Like, I spent a lot of money on that bottle give me the bottle so she snatches the bottle away from my sister and then i guess walks away so i've gone to my sister and she's just like some shrek just like took this bottle away from me and i'm just like oh, who is she like i don't even know i think it's um red's friend's sister i was like oh damn so obviously red had like a bunch of other guy friends that were there and um they had like he had a sister and she was just fucking anyways she was dusty and crusty she was probably jealous of my sister because my sister was looking good and she was looking like anyways let me not be rude let me not be rude let me not be rude <laughs> mm. okay so I've now joined my sister on the dance floor. We're having a good night. We're having a good night. We forgot about Shrek and we're just like, oh, it's just a bottle. Like, do you know what I mean? Whatever. So we're partying the whole night, partying the whole night. Red's friends, they're like guys, like they're like a bunch of guys. So we're all like having fun with them. Like we're all having fun, like a good old time. We're all dancing and having a good vibe. And we were talking to the guys. They were like all cool. Everybody was getting along. Everybody was getting along. Everybody was getting along. I didn't see the Shrek until actually the end. So I didn't really see her. It's the end of the boat party now. So this is when it goes left. Okay, so we're getting off the boat now. Everybody's like getting off the boat. Like there's just a bunch of commotion. We see Shrek. That's when I finally saw the Shrek. And I was just like, ew like why are you acting like that like why are you acting like that but yeah so we see shrek just yelling she's like wilding out like she's really wilding out and we're just like what's going on and then my sister's like oh yeah that's her so i was like oh forget her like forget about her like she's nothing so we're walking walking minding our business and then i turned to my sister i turned to my sister I was like, um, where's your wig? <laughs> I was like, oh, what the fuck? I was like, hold on. Where is your wig? Where is your wig? All of us were so confused. And then Red is like, I don't know if it was Red or Vodka or some other girl that was like, oh my God, Shrek just took, she has your wig, she has your wig. Oh my God, she just threw it in the Thames. She threw it in the Thames. She threw my sister's wig in the Thames. Yo, she threw my sister's wig in the Thames. And I'm just like, hold on, when did this happen? I was like, 
I was like to my sister, I was like to her, did you feel her take up? She's like, no, I did not feel nothing. I just, what the hell? So obviously my sister had like the canals in her hair. So obviously my sister's now starting to take out her canals. I was like, nah, she's taking the piss. Like she's, she's taking the piss. So I was like, let me go talk to her. Like just ask her why she take off her wig. Like it wasn't even a, on a whole, like I'm trying to beat this girl up. I'm trying to fight. Like, I'm trying to fight. I need a drink. So I just went, like, I, just, I was just like, oh, let me go talk to this girl. Like, let me talk to this girl because I don't know what the problem is. I just went there. It wasn't even on a fighting thing. I just went there. I just wanted to talk to the girl and be like, why did you take my sister's wig off and throw it in the Thames? Like there was really no need. Like there was really no need for that. And that just didn't make sense. So obviously I'm now marching, do my little catwalk to, um, to Shrek. And obviously Shrek's there with um, some guy and her brother. So I'm just like, all I said, <laughs> oh my God, oh my God. So I literally get towards, I was like, hi, hello. That's all I said, hi, hello. Like, hi, hello, excuse me. Can I get your attention, please? I wasn't even being rude. Why did Shrek's brother now, like why? There was really no need. Looking back on it, I'm just like, there is, there was really no need. There was really no need. <sighs> this guy grabs me by the throat. I'm in shock now. I'm just like, is this really happening? Is this really happening? And everything happened so quick. It was like, oh my God. So he grabs me by the neck, like he's, grabbed me by the neck like really really hard and all I remember him saying was why are you trying to chat to my sister why are you trying to chat to my sister you can't chat to my sister and then I just remember getting pushed on the floor I get pushed on the floor and then a bunch of guys I kid you not I kid you not a bunch of guys literally swarmed around me i'm on the floor so i'm like this i've now frumped up into like fetal position i'm covering my face like this and all i just feel is people kicking me and punching me i'm just like yo i'm gonna die i'm gonna die i was like i'm gonna die that's it i'm dead and then i blacked out It was really a mess. Looking back on now, I have to laugh because if I don't, then I'm just gonna really be in my feelings. So, obviously, I've woken up now. Like I've woken up now out of my whatever. And I'm just feeling pain in my head, everywhere. I'm just in pain, like I'm in pain. As the police trying to talk to me, they're like, oh, are you okay? Like, do you know your name? I'm like, yes, I know my name, like what the hell? He's like, oh, like, tell me what happened. I'm seeing my sister's crying, bawling her eyes out. I'm seeing Red is bawling her eyes out. I'm like, what is happening? Like, all I can feel is pain. I'm just in pain. My sister's yelling. Red is yelling. Like, it's just the police are just asking me stupid questions. I gave them my details or whatever. And then they were asking me, if I remember what the guys look like, I was like, no, I don't even, they just look like regular black guys to me. They really just look like regular black guys to me. I don't really remember faces like that. I'm thinking if I saw them again, I don't think I'll even remember their faces, to be honest. I really don't remember their faces. Like, I really don't remember their faces. So obviously police are asking me a bunch of questions. My sister's yelling, Red is yelling. I'm just like, this is a whole mess. I was just like... I couldn't even stand. I was disoriented. I was just like, oh, I just want to go home. The police were like, do you need an ambulance? Do you need an ambulance? Should we call the ambulance? I was like, no, I'm not going to no hospital. No, I just want to go home. Called the called, called Uber, called the Uber. So my sister called the Uber. We went, I went back to her place. The next day I'm just like, kind of, I'm pissed off. Like I'm actually pissed off because I'm just like, I can't believe that just happened. Did this really just happen to me? I really got jumped by a bunch of goons. I got jumped. They're not even goons. That's the problem. They're not even goons. You're a bunch of pussies. Now nah, I'm pissed off. My sister's pissed off. And I'm just like, 
oh wait hold on a second red is their friend that like, that's her friends like let her give me the number to these idiots and i'm gonna press charges like i'm gonna press charges I was like, I'm pressing charges, yeah. I'm pressing charges. I was like, yeah, I'm pressing charges. Um, but I just need the names and the numbers of these people. Red's like, oh, shit, yeah, it was really bad, but it didn't really have to happen like this. And, you know, but you know you were in the wrong because, like, why did you go over there? I was like, are you freaking kidding me? Like, she was just really waffling. She was really waffling. She wasn't even trying to give me these people's numbers or names or nothing. So I was really pissed off. I was just like, you know what? It's, even if I did have goons to go and beat these people up, I don't know their names. I don't know where they live. So it was kind of like Red was kind of protecting them, which was kind of like, hold on a second, I'm your family that I'm your family, like I'm actually your family, and you chose to protect them of your family. That's why I say, sometimes your family ain't your family. That's all I'm saying. Many people are fake as hell, disrespectful ass, but still it's kind of like, hold on a second, you really chose them assholes over your family. Okay, I remember that. I remember I will remember that. I will remember that for future, 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 future references because ain't nobody gonna disrespect me. I will remember that until the day I die. I'm a Scorpio. I hold on to things like luggage, luggage, luggage. Ooh. But yeah, literally. So that was the story of how Shrek's brothers tried to kill me. They tried to kill my ass. They kept moving and tried to kill me. But, you know, they was really doing the most. Like, really, really, like, really. Like, it's not even funny. Like, but you know what? You love and you learn. And you learn about people's loyalties. And where their loyalties stand and stuff like that but what i can do is just look now and then do you know what even is even more piss take here what is even more piss take basically um attention must have texted my sister the next day and he was like oh my gosh yeah how's your sister oh my gosh i saw what happened like that's crazy and my sister was like hold on a second are you dumb like are you stupid so you saw everything that was happening as it was happening and you didn't do nothing like are you okay are you okay and it's like your birthday like make it make sense like make it make sense because it all makes sense like you really some people are just not okay they're not okay. If I see you in public, I'll be like, mm. 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 Yeah, hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you share this video. Also, check out my other videos on my channel. I will be posting more videos more often. Probably like two videos a week. Yeah, make sure you... Tell your mom, tell your dad, tell your uncle, tell your sister, tell your brother, tell your cousin, your little nephew, your niece, your granddad, your grandmama, and crazy Sally that Nick, that lives next door. And even tell your dog, your cat, your pet lion, your pet octopus, your pet rabbit. Tell everybody, tell everybody. Make sure you tune in and I will be seeing you in the next video. So yeah. Bye. Where the hell does it go?